With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. Here we have this question. An object is kept on a smooth inclined plane of height 1 unit and length L units. The horizontal acceleration to be imparted to the inclined plane so that the object is stationary relative to the incline is. So um, let us try to draw this scenario in a diagram. So here we have this inclined plane and let us assume that the angle of incline is theta, right? And here there is a, a box kept on this inclined plane and its mass is m, right? The height of the incline is 1 unit, okay? And here the length will be l units. So this is 1 and this is l, okay? Now as it is a smooth incline, that means there is no friction between the box and the incline, right? That means under normal conditions, this box will start slipping down the slope. Okay, now in the question we have to find the amount of horizontal acceleration so that this box uh, does not slide down the incline. Okay, now uh, for that let us draw the uh, free body diagram for this incline. Here mg weight will be acting downwards. Okay, and this will be the normal reaction perpendicular to the plane. Now to keep the box stationary relative to the incline, we accelerate this incline in this direction. Okay. So this incline will be accelerating in this direction. Therefore, with respect to the inclined surface, there will be a pseudo force on the box in this direction. Okay. And that force will be equal to MA. Right. So let us try to resolve these force vectors with respect to the inclined surface. Okay. Uh, I have drawn these vectors again. And with respect to the axis of inclined surface, this will be angle theta that is angle of incline therefore this angle will also be theta okay therefore this vector here this will be mg sin theta okay also from here the ma pseudo force will be making the same angle theta with the incline therefore this resolution of ma will be equal to ma cos theta right so now for the box to remain stationary relative to the incline, I can equate these two forces mg sin theta will be equal to ma cos theta, right? So that means mg sin theta is equal to ma cos theta, right? Uh, the marks will get cancelled. Therefore, I can write a will be equal to um, g sin theta upon cos theta okay that means a is equal to g tan theta okay now let us try to find tan, tan theta tan theta is perpendicular upon base here perpendicular is 1 okay so 1 upon the base will be in this case this base okay the length of this base will come from Pythagoras theorem that will be under root of L square, right? Hypotenuse minus perpendicular minus 1 square. Okay. Therefore, this will be 1 upon under root of um, L square minus 1. Okay. Therefore, acceleration A that will be equal to um, G upon L square minus 1. Right. So, the correct option will be option C. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.